Every day, nearly two million people travel safely on London's underground railway network. But how many realize that this achievement is a direct result of the efforts of London Transport's training centre at Lambeth? Almost every piece of equipment in use on the underground system can be demonstrated in classrooms at the centre. In this lesson in train control, instructor David Havel uses scale models of trains and track to illustrate his explanation of safety devices. He shows how to prevent two trains getting on the same track. The trains are operated electrically by the instructor, or trainee, who gets an overall picture from an indicator screen. Only when the first train is clear of the crossover points can the signal lever be pulled to allow the second train on the line. But even if the driver fails to halt at the red signal, an automatic stop device takes over. something the passenger never sees. The device that immediately applies the brakes and cuts the power should the train pass a signal set at danger. Training is divided into four main categories for new entrants, promotion candidates, refresher courses and voluntary classes for those who just want to improve their knowledge. In the driver's cabin, the master controller and the dead man's handle are demonstrated by Chief Instructor Alex Gorton. Despite its grim name, the dead man's handle is a potential lifesaver. Because it has to be pressed down, the train stops should the driver fall ill and his grip relax. The training school was started in 1920 as part of a recruiting centre, but in later years was remodelled and eventually developed to its present state. Last year, 4,000 people attended classes here. In the specially constructed guards compartment, trainees learn about door control mechanism. And for your information, this is how it works. This little light you've often seen only shines when all doors are closed. A little lone but vital link in a network of efficiency. From the work